All right, in this video, I wanted to do this hobby versus retail. We have hobby packs down here in the front. Two hoops, elite, uh, basketball, 21-22, flux, illusions, chronicles, mosaic, and then Don Russ. And then the back, we have the biggest hodgepodge of craziness. Uh, it's kind of hilarious. NBA hoops, 18-19, Luca's year. Don Russ, 15-16, uh, uh, fat packs. Rookies and stars, fat packs, like four of them contenders um and that is the hangers and then we have this crazy rookies and stars full set but it has a three uh set a three card bonus pack or five card bonus pack something like that mega box down here and then we have uh, that's a playbook and then we have uh this guy right here so it's actually a little bit more expensive from the retail side than it is from the hobby but i wanted to throw in this rookies and stars as kind of an extra bonus one for us to open in this video so this is yeah, this is a lot. So these two are the most expensive hobby packs out of them, about 56 each. Kind of crazy. Hopefully we'll get a good hit out of either of these. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? This isn't even sealed. Yo, what? Uh, two. This isn't even sealed. Wow. I just got this straight up from, um, I'm not, I can't believe this isn't sealed. What in the world is this? That is terrible. Well, anyway, I'm going to have to contact them about that. That's unbelievable. I'm going to take a picture of this to show them proof that it like wasn't sealed. What the heck, man? Like, I didn't open this. Uh, anyway, this is a curveball that I did not expect. But uh, one of the packs was opened. That's outrageous, to be honest. Anyway, that one's a 56 for those two. These are 30, like 30. No, sorry. That one, 56, 56. I think this one's like 46. And then these two, 30, 30, and then 32. Uh, I think seven each, something like that, and then 20. So that's the breakdown. I can't even believe that. I don't want to start with this one because it's opened already, but I kind of do now. Oh, my goodness. That's crazy. I don't even, I don't know if they knew that, but uh, but that's seriously insane. Um, as for the the hobby side or the retail side of stuff, there's obviously quite a bit of just randomness. So... You know what? I'm not even going to sweat it. I can't wait. I got to see what the heck this is. Like, this is crazy to me that this would be set in here like this. And, like, that's, like, the most sketch thing I've seen all day is that. It does have nothing really in it, I don't think. That's probably why. Oh, my goodness, dude. So, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, there is something. There's an auto in this one. What the heck? Bridges, Kevin Love, Jalen Brown, Straight Fire, Anthony Davis even. That's a case hit, isn't it? Like, okay, and then we did get Magic. What in the world type of pack was this? So it was obviously open, and they didn't know it was opened, but it came with an auto. It's Otto Porter Jr., so not like one that we care about for the most part. Uh, Jane McDaniels here. That that was just weird. I've never experienced that before. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So yeah, we got all fifteen cards. Man. All right, I don't know what else to say about that other than that I'm super shocked and, like, can't believe that that would actually be the case. But any which way, we did get a couple of decent cards out of that. This is AD, not the one you, you want for straight fire, uh, but still a straight fire as well. Nice little, is it, I'm pretty sure that's a case hit, or it's a shoot, it's a uh, SP, short print, or, like, SSP, I'm not really sure, but... And even this Kevin Love is a nice color match for that. So, um, and Bridges, I'm not giving him any love over here, but Bridges as well for the 
mosaic, not terrible. I'm totally shook by this starting off this this box by having this happen but uh but it is what it is so i'm gonna go ahead i'm gonna throw some of these up here in the back now we're gonna stick to retail the rest of the way through that was just i guess the end of what we were looking at and we actually got i can't believe we actually got a couple hits before we even got started so there's the ad right here and that's like four dollars about right Seven bucks, five dollars for the auto. It's one dollar. So, yeah, it is what it is. And that's mosaic. That's a mosaic one right there. Crazy, man. I mean, it's like probably like a five dollar auto. Any which way. Really weird that this was opened like that. I think it wasn't even sealed. Panini needs to do better. Like, way better. I'm looking to see if there's little marks on there. Have you guys ever had that happen? I mean, that's seriously insane to me for a $58 pack. It's uncalled for. Anyway, we'll start off Rookies and Stars. We've got four of these, I think four of these fat packs. And then um, we'll just rip through all of the retail and then get through it. So this is Fat Packs, Rookies and Stars. There's a whole bunch of just miscellaneous things that you can get in here. Uh, red waves and stuff. But you can get numbered cards in, in these fat packs. Or at least I got one that was maybe an accident when I got one a long time ago. Uh, for those that want that, there you go. But anyway, yeah, it was kind of weird. I did get some from these a long time ago, and I'll just go like this to uh, to keep it moving because we have trash, trash, t -t -t Naj there, and then that for the insert, and then for the rookies we have Zach and those other rookies. There's Jamar. There's tons, I mean, tons and tons of base rookies in this set. If you open any of it, there's you're guaranteed to get, like, all of the base rookies just because there's so many of them. But at least that's what it feels like because I've opened quite a bit of them. But we got Zach and Jamar off of those. And then we have DJ, Mike, Justin, Mixon, Wentz, Allen, Cam, Antonio, Robinson, DJ. There is the green Crowder and then we have Jefferson there's a studded Lawrence nice and a Kurt Warner uh, airborne there so nice wavy looking card here star studded I don't think this one's probably worth very much but still cool uh, this one's these ones are kind of hard like honestly these um, you get all these different types of the same cards and different sort of parallels like pretty often so Let's see if it even pulls it up why I'm surprised it's not pulling it up to be honest there it is hmm. doesn't even have it listed so it is what it is though this is one of those sets though that's been pretty fun it's a little bit inconsistent but fun and I'll put all of the like I guess the inserts and top rookies and stuff aside for you guys for the end i'll just i'll do these ones i guess this time and uh, as in trash so there's gonna be a lot to recap it's gonna be ridiculous so buckle up it's gonna be a long one especially since i was only two packs and we got a bunch more so i'll try to get through it quicker than whoops than that first one there um because again volume is the thing got a lot of volume and that's the fun part i like to be able to get through these things there's derek and there is tutu we got a Trask and Pitts for the two wavy uh, inserts there. Kind of nice. And a couple other. There's a Fields there. Smith, not bad. Um, let's see here. See me. Other dudes. Jacob, Patrick, Pitts. And I mean, I could pull them out, but I'm going to put those ones aside. And then the rest, doom, bang, 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 bang. So, number two. These are kind of random. I ended up getting these from Target again. They restocked online just randomly. And so I was like, really? Posted it and, like, posted on, like, I think my, I think maybe I just shared it with some of my friends and stuff. And then the next day they were sold out. So I was like, eh, happy that I ended up. Scooping them up, not bad. All right, so then we have on this side, a couple dudes, a couple dudes. The funny thing is if you ever get a um, 
Burrow, there's always like a what's his name right after it. Burrow, and then it's always um, his uh, rival homie. DK, and then that's nice. DK in the green, too. Nice little coloring match. There's Kyle Pitts. There is a Justin Fields. Nice. And we have Jefferson. Russell Wilson touchdowns. Tony. So a couple fun little inserts here. Come on, Ross St. Brown. And Sermon. So those are all the rookies. And then a couple of the other dudes there. There you go. So what? who was I saying? Not uh, Herbert. Sorry. So there's Herbert usually as well. So I would put Justin up here. This is my best one so far. But we got one more to get through. And so far we got some pretty good pulls for just a couple of little things. Nothing insane, but nice little um, waves for the fat packs. Not mad at all about that. It's nice to get at least a couple good good names in, in the mix. So uh, I'd love to see if there was better parallels and stuff that, that popped up. But honestly, it's hard to, to make that happen. So there's Herbert. Oh, yeah, weird. So this time... It's not the case. Usually it's it's what's the name in front of Herbert. And I've had that happen like 10 times. It's crazy. Daniel and Ronnie Perkins. And then we have Baker. And there's Mac. Look at that. Nice. That's a stellar rookies. Not bad at all. Take it. I'll take it. Look at it. Boop. Sorry about that, Justin. So studded. And then I guess Trevor's probably more important than just Justin over there. But. It is what it is, though. All right, a couple other inserts. There's Trevor, Patty Fries, and Company, and there's Mac Base. All right, so that is the way Rookies and Stars looks. I actually like Rookies and Stars. It's kind of like a feel-good set. There's so many random hits that you can get. It's pretty awesome. Um, nothing unbelievably awesome, but just some, some fun stuff nonetheless. So I'll put those ones aside, and then I guess to, for the recap, I don't want to recap all the greens and stuff. There's just too many. So I will recap the guys like that, unless there was some good, I guess, DK. I like that one because it's color match. And then Justin and that guy. So we'll put these aside and then recap all these at the end. Moving on, you know what, we'll stick it to, to football. I was going to say basketball, but we'll stick Stick to football. There's a lot more football in here than basketball, so it just ended up being all I had left, honestly. Sometimes I have more product than not. This has hanger box exclusives, and yeah, here's a look at the pays. Uh, if you hit one of these crazy things, pretty pretty crazy to hit gold. Um, maybe not likely, but possible maybe. I've never hit anything too crazy out of. Contenders, especially from the retail side, yet I still buy it. And I was buying random things. I was like, let's just go ahead and get two more of these little guys. Maybe one of them will be a good one. And they'll prove me wrong yet again. Let's see. So moving from front to back, there's Brady, Miles. There was a Bobby in the red and also Terrell Davis in red. Dak Prescott in red at Chain Movers. Tylen Wallace, red. And Matt Ryan, red MVP. Rookie of the Year. Uh, Mac Jones, which that one would have been in red. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So those dudes, nothing insane there. Buddha Bakes and Mr. Brady on the back there. So. That is uh, the way that cookie crumbles. I don't think any of these are numbered. I'm going to guess not. I wish that Brady would have been numbered. That would have been cool. But nothing super insane there. Uh, nice couple inserts here. I guess I'll throw those aside too. But uh, quick and painless, I guess. It's like I'm numb from it. I, you know, that, um, that mosaic pack was still trippy, dudes. Like the fact that it was opened when I got it and it was obviously an error it wasn't like on purpose because you could see like I got an auto in it unless they like switched autos with me for, for like a really good auto or something but I don't think that there was any foul play or anything like that I, like at first I was kind of tripping but 
Ooh, look at that. There you go. Not expecting a nice hit from this, but Supernatural is in the red parallel. That's got to be worth a buck. Look at the little corners dinged, of course. Of course, of course. Can't expect it to be perfect because it never is. That's just the nature of the game. It seems like anytime there's a hit, it's definitely dinged. Curtis, Stefan Diggs. There is Najee Harris, Rookie of the Year. That's nice. And Josh Allen, MVP in the red. Steve Young, Brown, 2-2, two, two. and then Hertz, Gates, is it uh, Trevor Lawrence even, nice, Supernatural, and Jerry Rice to round it out, that's not bad, they've got some good little uh, cards here, so nice to see uh, some, uh, some bigger names in the mix here, Trevor Lawrence, Najee Harris, nice. Very good, very good, very good. So cool, nice, uh, nice little hits. Nothing absolutely crazy, but nice little hits off of the contenders. Doo -doo -doo -doo. We're gonna go right over here. Fat packs. This is fifteen, sixteen out of here, and then looks like there's rated rookie hollows to ninety nine, and that's pretty much it, as far as I can tell. Um, I believe this is Tatum's year. And who else? I'm not sure if you guys want to throw in some names. Feel free in the comment section. But Don Ross looking very dated in this set. As I've said before, there's Clay, Bledsoe, Dwight, Corey, Courtney Lee. There is an Elite. And look at the nice Passing Kings Oscar Robertson. This is kind of cool. Different um, feel on here. Different texture. Uh, Mr. Wright is the rated rookie, and then another rated rookie, we got Joker, nice, the rookies, that's got to be some something here, this is, uh, I forgot it was his rookie year too, so this one, I, that one has to be worth like, what, $10, I'm going to guess $10, maybe not, 20 bucks. That one is, is it doesn't even look the same though. It's like silver. Yeah, it's like 20 bucks. Pretty solid. That was a good hit. I'll take that all day long. Crazy. The, and the rookies one too. Like, that's, uh, that's not a bad hit at all. Cool, man. That is awesome. Kind of weird looking card to be honest though, but, uh, but cool. And I don't know if I've opened those ones before. Feels like I have, but maybe I haven't. Anyway, a couple more rookies there. I'll put these ones aside, and we'll get to the other fat pack because we got two of those ones and then one of the others. So, and the others being 1819. We're trying to get an Aluka, hopefully in like a parallel would be awesome. These ones are kind of fun. I got these off of like Dave and Adams or something like that online, um, and they were pretty decently priced. I think they're on sale or something. Sometimes I usually just fall for their sales and then buy a couple of just random older things and this is one of them so i don't know why this one's sticking so hard here they're really carmelo anthony nice sticking on rudy there and then oh man spacer they're really messing with me dominique nice tim hardaway nice love that this guy was a, a gangster back in the day this dude again wow there's tyus nice and then looney not bad either. And Joe Young. So a couple rooks there. Nothing terrible. Tim Hardaway. I like it. Dominique Wilkins. I like it. I'll throw all you guys over here in the recap. Because I'm, I'm like the older generation, dude. Definitely like seeing some of those guys in the mix. So very cool. And I think that was, yeah, starting here. Okay, so this is, I'm trying to keep my football and my basketball separate. Because I usually keep them all separate when I, uh, storm and stuff so all right moving on now we have i guess this two football footballs and then we'll go right into um the hobby stuff but hopefully you guys like these videos if you do drop a like um give me a drop a subscription drop a subscribe <laughs> you think i'd have that down by now but uh but i don't oh my dog needs in the room she's scratching i'm gonna have to go get her in a second here let's finish this pack all right, we are chasing 
Luca. Trey Luca. Not Trey. Luca. Trey. Millsap. Howard. There's Andre. Come on, baby. I always get Joel, too. It's kind of crazy. Uh, Draymond. And then, ooh, this one looks cool, but it's probably not anything fancy, but it's a silver or, or a red. Or like it's a nice looking one. Cool looking one. I'll put that aside. And there's a nice Lillard for my PC and Dirk. Bledsoe, Rudy, Patrick, and Kobe Bryant. Man. All right. Good to see Kobe. Depressing, but good to see him. This one's kind of cool, though. I'm curious about that get out of my way thing or whatever that says. That's how I read it. Who knows what it actually says. One dollar, but mine's a foil, so it's 81 cents. What about you, Mac? Red Supernaturals, eight dollars. What about you, Mac? Ten dollars ish. Like a couple bucks here and there. Oh, we already got you. We already got you. Okay. All right, cool. Well, we've got a couple of fun ones over here for the recap again. Next, we have a couple more here, but let me get my dog real quick. All right, my dog Chloe is in the building now. So if you hear the snorting, she has finessed her way upstairs away, away from the wife. Had to get in the room to come sit by me. I love this old dog, man. She's like 15 years old. Anyway, here we go. I'm going to do playbook um, next. Mega, five cards, four per box, one auto or mem. I'm hoping we get an auto in this one. That'll be... Pretty legit to get an auto. Um, there's two purple parallels, and then you can get it in motion on flies and more. And then here is a look at those sort of things right there. For the most part, playbook has been pretty gnarly to me. Nothing, nothing very nice to be honest. <laughs> but uh, but I still coming back. I still come back for more. So uh, it is what it is, right? Trying to have my way and find my way through it and, and find something good. So here we go. Greg, Commission Zones, and Chris Evans and Jammin. All right. Not the start I was looking for, but it's okay. We only have four packs. Might as well, might as well be a hobby box because there's so few. Jerry, we have Mike, whoops. Dez, and then there's Jamar, base, nice. Got something at least. There's Levi on the purple. So we got at least one base rookie. Feels like that one's the man. A little bit big. Maybe we'll get an RPA. Who knows? I know. I actually know who knows. Um, I know, and it's not going to be an RPA. But that's the negative energy that I that I don't need to to have because and it just turns out being true. So hope for the best. There's a thick boy right there, though. Not going to happen. And book. Dun, 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 dun. And there it is. So, gridiron gear. Not worn. Not from any, like, blah, blah, blah. You know how it is. And then Mr. Jared. So, you know what? Sometimes you hit. Sometimes you miss. With playbook, 99 is a miss. And then... That's all, that's all we can expect. Anyway, that's what we got. Two purples, one fancy looking one, and then one of these things. I'll put this over the side. Last, two more things at retail, man. This is crazy, but I'm only going to open this quick. And I can't believe I bought another one of these things. I, I just, I, they came back in stock, and I was like, yeah, I really like the, 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 uh, the set. The factory set looks nice, first of all, for those that have never seen it. You get the factory set, but you also get five bonus cards. Uh, which is my favorite part. It's that extra high gamble there on it. But you get a blue or green, gold, black, 50 to 1. So you can actually get a 1 of 1 out of here, which is crazy and fun, you know. And you also do get Pulsar um, cardstock on the base, which makes this, like, way, way cooler looking than the other stuff. So that's part of the reason why I like it. I don't like how they put Mr... There's the extra pack right here. I don't like how they put Mr. Trevor Lawrence right here, though. Check this out. In the very pack. Raw dogged against the wall. There's uh, the Pulsar Trevor Lawrence. <laughs> it's so bad. I don't know why they do that, but that's what's happening. Anyway, that's the whole set right there. I'm going to put this one aside. 
because there's the Mac from this and uh, all the rookies and stuff from that set, which is fun to, to see. But this is what I came for. And this is kind of like an extra bonus. I mean, I'm doing like 100 or 250 plus this more or less uh, in the box. So hopefully we see gold. I see a lot of red and green. That's not good. Okay. Devonta Smith, though, at least we got a red, nice red there. Uh, it's Darren Hall. Dalvin Cook. And a green Caleb Farley. And another Darren Hall. <laughs> what? Are you joking me? I really did that? Wait, so this one's numbered 5 out of 50. And then this one is not numbered. Are you... You gotta be kidding me. I got two of the same one out of a five pack. That's embarrassingly terrible, but at least we got a Devonta Smith. Uh, I've got a couple different random set ones from this set before. I got, I think a JJ Watt or something like that, a gold. And this one is green to 25. So Caleb Farley Titans, number two, almost a jersey, but not. And um, yeah, to 25, that's kind of, unfortunate and then these guys are not numbered so that's one of the worst ones i've gotten actually so probably not doing that again i like the gold in the backdrop there or at least it looks gold it's not Cur curious about the devonta smith i feel like that one's probably like a six dollar card right here let's see no it's not gonna show it huh what about you mr darren stinking in stinking up the whole thing all right, well, those are El Terrible, but I'll put them aside anyway. That's unfortunate. But, uh, yeah, I mean, to 25, that's kind of crazy. Uh, Joker, I'll put you back here. Fields, actually, maybe I'll put this guy over top of Fields over here, so keep it mixed up a little bit. And then, like that, I don't really know. I don't really know. All right, last box, and then we got Hobby, and this is a big one. So these ones are actually on sale, or were on sale on Fanatics for 50, maybe 55-ish. I think they retail at 65, which is outrageous, and I bought so many of these. But they do have the green ice, and I've been trying to get a green ice Cade. But you basically, you can get a rookie auto as well. And I finally got one green ice auto, but it wasn't of the big, I'd say, five or however many players was a, a rookie though, I believe, but I'll have to go back and check the video because I don't remember. I don't remember which no namer I pulled, but anyway, lots of packs, value pack, city here, 20 packs or something like that. So I'm gonna get to cracking because we got a long way to go. Um, and let's see here. If the uh, sound sounds a little bit better than it has in the past or worse, leave a comment. Let me know. There's Levert because I'm using uh, my headphones like an iPhone headphone with it so I can try to keep the the sound away from the ripping of the packs since I did see some complaints of that in the past which I totally get it's just impossible for me to kind of you know miss like in a sense it's not easy to to avoid because the pack like literally right here in front of the camera so anyway trying to listen but I'm trying some new things out and seeing if they work just since it's kind of like I'm learning as I go here miles and there's a nice maxi second year I think I already got that one. But nice one, though. I think that guy's going to have a nice long-term career. All right. We have a Bradley Beal. And can we get another auto? I'd really like to get a Cade or a Barnes or a Mobley in the green cracked. Maybe all three of them would be cool. Not to be greedy, but I feel like I've bought enough of these that I'm waiting for the big hit. And this is my... As of now, my last box, I think actually I'll have a couple more of these coming just because I'm on sale. I can't reviews the sale since I've paid retail for them already, but is that a Davian? Davian on the back, maybe? Bang, bang, choo-choo train. Nope. That's a bummer. Bummer. All right. I do like... One thing about this set, and that's they don't waste our time with a bunch of mem cards like every other set is trying to do now. Oh, look at that. Complete players mellow. Nice. There we go. Nice little little hit there. Nothing super crazy, but nice to see a, a mellow. And in green crack, even though it's a second year, that would be a good 
be a good one to hold on to. Put them over the side. All right. So I should probably just put them back in the middle because they're all going to go there. Let me recap like all the parallels and stuff like I said. So even these crappy ones that I'm getting, which is okay. There's Zaire. Nice rated rookie there. But yeah, this is a fun box to rip, honestly. It's like a lot of packs. If you just if you have the itch to like wanna to rip like some uh some packs and stuff, I mean it's not a bad rip. You get some decent little hits, it's just not like super high ceilings, you know. But it's nice to be able to see some of the players that you'd you'd want to get on paper and stuff, so it's a good one. I, it's the first one that I ripped with my kid actually. It's one of uh I don't know if it was this one or just Don Russ in general was a Don Russ Mega Box. I think it was a regular one. But he had a lot of fun, you know, and he has some of those cards. And there's a Harden. And he'll probably end up hopefully with some good cards after well, he'll end up with most of my stuff anyway when he gets older. But hopefully he'll end up with some good cards from his interest in ripping as he gets older too so hopefully we'll have some fun with it because he's a pokemon fanatic he's so good like he has the best luck on pokemon cards as soon as he starts doing sports cards with me dude he'll have way better hits than me there's a rudy always in the mix there's a keon always in the mix too i feel like rudy and um rick rubio both of those dudes are the always like the the numbered kings like you get like a numbered card for one of, of one of those guys like all the time at least seems like i do but trying to get through this quick so we can get down to that hobby stuff hopefully we got some good hits this time around this hobby there's the lamello again same thing different uh different type which is the base card i mean but yeah that was super weird that hobby pack it's like i've never seen one open like that and they just had just terrible inserts like, I don't know what to, I don't know what to say, man. I mean, what if they, like, it's any which way, it's, like, not a good look. Even if it was something that was not noticeable or, or that they just didn't notice. The fact that that made it past quality control of whoever packaged these things up was not a good thing. You know what I mean? And I don't want to call them out, but it's, like, not uh, not super awesome. Because, like, I mean, I can't help but go to the worst spot and be like, well, what if they had, like, a really good straight fire and they replaced it with that one? Or they had really good inserts and they replaced them with mediocre inserts? I mean, we're, like, I mean, good type of inserts, but low, like, like value players. Because they knew, like, I wouldn't su suspect that it was potentially tampered with then if I, that can happen. But those combined are, like, $4 or something, like, or, le or less. So it is kind of like a little bit sketchier. It's, I, again, I don't think there's foul play, but sometimes I just can't help think like when I don't know who's on the other end, what they're capable of, especially in this biz. You guys already know. Same with the sneaker biz, but this biz is just as bad, like, or worse, right? Like people are snakes. So there is no top rookie action here at all, and this was my last one for now. So that was a bummer. But that was how Don Russ was looking. And that was a lot of this and a lot of L City, but uh, still fun nonetheless. I'll put these aside for review later, but at least we got got like a nice mellow and stuff. Nothing too too insane. But that was all of the retail stuff. So got a couple nice hits on this side over here. Um, we'll recap them all at the end, but let's get into the nitty gritty. We'll start off here with hoops, and then we'll work our way from that to here 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 like that something like that so here's hoops versus older hoops at least you can get some nice stuff out of hoops though i'll tell you maybe i won't get it this time but there's lebron like the autos some some of the autos are kind of nice there's bassy and the parallel is a jalen green so sometimes it ends up like that all right Moving on, we have something. Ooh, we got something back here. Oh, be a good player. Be a good player. All right, here we go. So we have that guy, and then look at You see the little 75? I've never actually got one of these yet. 75-year anniversary. 75-year, oh, boy. <laughs> Malcolm. 
Brogdon, no, that's not bad. I mean, he's, he's good, right? Ish? I don't know. 54 of 75. Not the one you want to see, my friends. Not the one you want to see, but still cool nonetheless. Uh, I have not got one of those, so very, very fun to get something that you have not achieved yet. Got a couple of anniversaries, but none of those ones, so cool. All right, at least we got something. It doesn't feel as, the sting doesn't feel as bad, but these ones, not really worth noting. I guess that one I'll throw over there. All right, next up, Elite. Feast or Famine Elite, as we know it. I've opened, I think, two or three hobbies of these. Really enjoy it. Such a fun um, box. At first, I was like, oh, this is a lot of money. But then, you know, you get a couple of decent little hits, and you're like, oh, yeah, it's kind of fun. Looks like we got blue. I think that one's to 75 or 50. So Halliburton. There's Bane, second year. Koro, second year. Daniel and Kyle. Yeah, KP and hiding behind KP. We have, hmm, to 99. My bad. At least we got a numbered card. Could have been worse. Was a bit worse in other videos. So we got a couple numbered cards there to put us on the board. Not terrible. Not terrible. Not terrible. I mean, it's kind of like the best of the worst. Like, you get a numbered card. It is, unfortunately, not a great player. But you still don't feel like it's an L so much because it's a number card. Is that the way it's supposed to be? I'm not really sure. That's the way it feels. This is a, a lot, though, because this is about, again, a pair of Jordans for this little stack over here. Um, let's see if we can earn it back, though. Let's see. I doubt it, as usual. But incoming P. Will and a Trey Jones. So that is all we got from this side. Boohoo, putting um, the hobby over here for the recap. All right, so that is quick and, and dirty, 30 bucks. P. Will incoming. I don't know. Actually, I'm going to look at that because, you know what, I don't know these cards very well, and some of them are short prints, and I don't know. So, And I doubt this is one, but because it doesn't look like one, it's pretty, pretty weak sauce. One dollar. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. That's, that's what I'm talking about unfortunately all right so we have illusions this is one that can be really good this is one oh we got a, a thick boy oh no did we know we didn't get a space didn't we? oh no it's a card all right we got something it's an rpa what is it be something nice treat me nice first impressions Sadiq Bay. Ooh. Nine of ten. Yo. We got a gold first impressions. Look at that patch, too. Looks nice. His auto is a little bit... Uh, <laughs> Yo, that was crazy. That's what I'm saying, man. These things can be feast or famine on this side. I gotta get a sleeve for that one because it's too big. But there's Kemba Walker in the orange, and then Isaiah Stewart and Butler uh, to finish out that pack. So it's just five cards. It's so feast or famine. But like if you hit, you get lucky and you hit that um, the one. You know, man, that was a really low number too. Five, one of five. That's the second one of five that I've actually got. Oops, this one goes on the other side. I forgot. These two were from Hobby, so I'm doing Hobby. I have that side. I don't have a sleeve for this one right away, though. But And this is so thick, uh, you can't even do the cut trick on the other one. Uh, but number 9 of 10, that's crazy. Dang. All right. Well, I did not expect that. Very, very cool. Gold card. That's crazy, man. Sheesh. I hate to keep moving around because I don't want to touch it, but... I do kind of want to put them right here instead. Man, that was dope. I wish, oh man, I wish it was like the next year. A little Kate action of that would have been nuts. But uh, Sadiq Bay is not bad. He's pretty decent, right? Okay. Of course it could have been better. Don Russ Hobby. This is basically what we were opening except for the elevated form. Hopefully there's an auto in here because I'm not seeing any color. Lots and lots of this. Base. Base. 
space in our face. We got lots of it. All right. Now we have some rooks here. So we got Franz, Franz, Kamunga. There's Cade finally. Nice. Greg Brown. There's a press proof DeAndre Ayton right there. So the press proof. We have Barkley. And we have uh, Donovan Mitchell, Craftsman. There's a Luca. Net, not bad. Not the real press proof because you see it's white down here, not black. Bummer for that because if it was the other one, it would have been nice. There's Larry Bird Retro. And we have Terrence Ross to 199. Nothing fancy there to end out that pack. But the Luca is nice. I think that's probably the best that we got over here on the, the net marbles. I actually really like these. And Luca is a solid one. So I'll throw Luca right in the mix. Bang. And nice to get another Cade and uh, a couple of rookies here too. Come on, go. So a couple of decent hits here. Nothing super, super wild, but uh, something worth recapping a couple of them over here. And then the last one, the one that's been good and bad, Chronicles. This is, I actually got my best hit from Chronicles. Um, one of these guys, just one single pack, that got a Lamello um, Redemption, which was insane. So what is that? Is that Spacer? Oh man, Spacer, okay. Well, that sucks. That means we didn't get the big thing, right? Or does it? I don't know. Peyton, Anthony Edwards. It's nice to see Edwards. Again, this is their rookie year. This is a Kuro. And it is number 49. So, 49 a Kuro. There is the spacer that we don't want. We've got one on each side now. There's P. Will. There is Maxi. And there's Naismith. And there's Luca. She's Louise. That one was brutal. Super brutal. The one card we got was this one, I guess, then the Okoro to 49. Nice lower number, I guess, but still. 46 to 49. Hmm. All right, it is what it is. That's the way it works sometimes. And you got Luca again. Naismith, Maxi, I like that one, Silver, uh, Heroes, I'll throw it in the thing, it's worth a dollar, I think, and the centering's always off, but I don't want it to get all scratched, and then P-Wheel, Base, One, I've got a bunch of those ones, and I have to just look through these and double check, because some of them are numbered, and it's hard to tell on some of them, so, alright, that is the rip, man, that's how we ended up, how do you guys think we did, who ended up winning this battle? Uh, retail or hobby this is uh, retail on this side hobbies on this side ended up with some pretty decent hits got a couple mac jones on this side the the joker on this one's really nice too but we'll get in and, and let's recap uh first we'll recap retail and we'll go over most of these things here this is going to be quick but we'll i figured we'll go over this and then the bigger hits uh as quick as we can at least i'm sorry quentin Rudy, Harden, Tucker, that guy. Maxi's nice, I guess. That one's probably a good one. Levert. And then for football, this one sucks, man. Um, there's Darren Hall there, too. Hopefully he ends up good. Chase. And a couple other dudes here. Gridiron Gear. Ian Book. Kobe Bryant. Lillard. The Pulse. Joel and... Um, company that westbrook one looks cool but not worth anything we have wilkins hardaway tice jones that one's probably worth something right a dollar kevin looney joe young and a couple other rookies here oscar bird and then we have allen and a couple other reds there's mac jones matt ryan in red nice there prescott and bobby we have Kyle Trask, and then Justin Fields, Kyle Pitts, DK, like those ones. And then Pitts, Baker, Base, Base, a couple of the rookie dudes there. Kurtz, and then Jamar and Zach again. So a couple, I mean, decent hits, not, not crazy. I mean, this isn't bad. I, I'm happy with the amount of just randomness that we had. And some of these other ones I need to look at prices on because I don't know how much like a Tyus Jones is or... 
I mean, a couple bucks, I would imagine, for some of those ones, if that. But fun to, to pull nonetheless. And then uh, for the, I guess, the heavier side, it would probably be like this. We got the Lamello, Cracked Ice, green like that. The Darren Hall, this one is numbered to 50. Uh, nice. Uh, Devonta Smith, no numbers. Trevor Lawrence, Supernatural. Najee Harris in red. The uh, Mac Jones, Supernatural in red. This is a Stellar Rookies, Mac Jones and the Trevor Lawrence. Caleb in, this is a 225, and then Justin Fields, and then the bigger one that we got uh, back here. We got Joker, and it kind of looks like the foils running off down there. Kind of a bummer, cause, unless they're all like that, but that one's pretty bad. Can't read the whole name, but that one's the best card it looks like. It looked like that one's around 25 or so dollars. And then I'm guessing it would probably be that Mac Jones followed by like that one. And then probably the Trevor would be the the top four, I guess, on this side. And then some of these other ones down here. So not terrible, not terrible at all. A couple numbered cards at least, especially since I had that Rookies and Stars thing. But then this side we had Okoro numbered and then the Rookies and Stars that we just saw here, nothing too crazy. Luca, I wish that one was the numbered one. Unfortunately, not. And then with the press roof there, Terrence Ross, numbered in 199. A couple of rookies. Kemal Walker, I think this is orange. And then Jalen Green, incoming P. Will and Trey Jones. Cal Bridges, Kevin Love, nothing too crazy here. And then we still ended up with a couple pretty nice hits here. So, oddly enough, this was the weirdest thing I've ever seen to have a pack that was like opened like what so weird but an autograph came out of it auto porter jr okay uh luca press non-press proof but uh the net marbles nice to see that always welcome got malcolm brogdon brogdon i don't know how to say his name but 75 year anniversary love that that's really cool too then we got this one this one's crazy man sadiq bay first impressions i need to get a sleeve on this thing before i keep Handling it, but nice uh, RPA, man. Wish it was on card, but, you know, that's the way the cookie crumbles. It doesn't look like it's in bad shape it, for the most part, which is a huge plus and not very often that happens. But then we got a straight fire, Anthony Davis, uh, with that opened pack, and then um, Dante here, 44 of 99. So, well, who do you think did better? You guys leave a comment, let me know. I really think it was, I know that one's a low numbered card. But I don't think that the Sadiq Bay is worth a lot, though, to be 100% honest. So, I think that we're kind of almost even, to be honest. This has to be like better than, let's see. I don't know what I'm working with here. I feel like this one's probably not going to be worth very much, but. It's like not even close. Let's double check this again down here. Hmm. Isaiah Stewart is 60, and that's he's better than Stewart, right? Gosh, this is terrible. First impressions. My first impression of this app. Is it does not work. Center stage, for those wondering. It's probably me. There's 15 on that one. That one's like 8. It says 6. We already know that one's 25 or so. Trevor Lawrence. Can't get a good angle on it. All right, I'll give up. Sorry for wasting your guys' time. I uh, would love to see how much it's worth. But I think that actually, I don't know, that one's like 25. That one's probably like 50 or so. And then that one's 15, 8, I don't know, $1, $2. Tough call. Leave a comment. Let me know who you think won, though. Appreciate y'all for stopping by and watching. If you guys want to see more of these videos, be sure to subscribe and then check back on the channel because I post on a regular basis. But have a good one. Thanks for watching. See you guys.